How to apply Casor on Weed Killer While Casor on herbicide kills broadleaf and grassy plants, it leaves well-established deep-rooted plants intact. The active chemical ingredient in Casoran is diclobenil. The manufacturer, Shimter Canada Company, produces Casoran in the shape of granules for ease of application. The chemical becomes volatile in high temperatures and loses much of its effectiveness. Shimtera recommends application during temperatures of less than 59 degrees Fahrenheit. You can apply Casoran by hand, with small spreading equipment, or with tractor-mounted spreaders. Things you will need Casoran Chemical resistant gloves Long sleeved shirt Long pants Closed toed shoes Herbicide spreader optional Water Wet mulch optional Allow any wanted plants to grow to maturity with established roots Allow any transplanted crops to grow for 4 weeks before applying Casoran. Clear any weeds by hand or with cultivating equipment in early spring or late fall. Spread granules evenly over the soil. According to Shintura, apply 1.5 to 2.5 ounces of Casoran per 40 square feet. The Arnold Arboretum recommends applying 1 ounce per 20 square feet. Irrigate with half to 1 inch of water to allow the granules to dissolve. Alternatively, cover the granules with wet mulch. Repeat each year as needed. Tips Warnings Casoran is not for light sandy soils as the chemical will seep down too far, harming established plants and failing to kill soil surface weeds. Shimtura says to apply the higher recommended rate in the first year and the smaller amount each succeeding year for maintenance. Alternatively, you may repeat the higher recommended rate of application every other year if needed. Always wear protective gear and do not ingest the material. Wash hands thoroughly following application. Do not touch your face while applying or allow the chemical to get on your skin. Do not over-apply. <laughs>